here at home. Plenty of excitement in Canton this weekend as celebrations continue for the Pro Football Hall of Fame's Class of 2023. Today, thousands gathered for the 60th annual Canton Repository Grand Parade. News 5's Remy Murray introduces us to the fans who have been coming back now for decades. Welcome to what fans call football's own version of heaven. When people come and they, and they get enshrined into the Pro Football Hall of Fame and they see everything that we do here for them, it makes them want to come back every year. This excitement is felt not only for those honorees being inducted, but also for people like Dave McAllicker. You gotta love it. You gotta love it every time, every year. McAllicker is one of many who looks forward to this big event in Canton that brings thousands year after year. We love it, bring the family down. I actually go to Pennsylvania, pick up family members from there, bring them over and uh, have them get autographs. What's even more special about McAllicker is that he's been coming to the Pro Football Hall of Fame's festivities for 40 years. I'm 52 and so yeah, ever since well, I moved up here from Pennsylvania, it's been a yearly thing and uh, as a youngin, we used to go and jump the fence at the Hall of Fame game just to get in and watch. In order to make each year magical for people like McAllicker. Just get here one time in your life. It takes these amazing floats, live performances, and special appearances from football stars like Joe Thomas. <laughs> Kim Davenport says it also requires help from more than 2,500 volunteers. We have such great volunteers who even take vacation to welcome our guests to Canton every year. So this is a labor of love for us. As the Canton Repository Grand Parade closes out its 60th year, fans say they can't wait to reunite once again next summer. I don't know how else I would celebrate Hall of Fame. In Canton, Remy Murray, News 5.